Good evening, everyone. My name is Kevin Duran. I'm assistant principal over at Martin Kellogg. I want to welcome you here tonight to our joint John Wallace and Martin Kellogg Orchestra performance for the spring. I know you're excited as I am. I get to hear these students every single day practice, and I get to see the live stream of the Wallace students, and um, it's quite impressive. So I want to welcome you. A couple of reminders. If there is an emergency, which has never happened, but you never know. We have exits on both sides. We will meet you out in the front parking lot, and we'll bring your kids there. All right, so we are going to start with our grade five orchestra, and I hope you enjoy the evening. Good evening, everyone. My name is Mary Paula Zonis, and I am the orchestra director at Martin Kellogg Middle School, John Wallace Middle School, and I also teach music over at John Patterson School. And I would like to welcome you to our spring orchestra concert. So before we begin, and I turn the program over to our students, um, I'd just like to ask the fifth grade orchestra a show of hands or bows. How many of you went to elementary school at Elizabeth Green School? How many of you went to elementary school at Anna Reynolds School? How many of you went to elementary school at John Patterson School? Thank you. And Ruth Chafee School? Thank you. Anybody from another district, perhaps? Sometimes we get students who move from other places. OK. Um, one more question for our fifth graders. How many of you are in your very first orchestra concert because you started brand new this year? Can you raise your bows? Come on, don't be shy. There's quite a few of you. <laughs> All right. And how many of you are playing a different instrument than the one you maybe played in fourth grade? There's a few of you, too. There we go. All right, thank you. So we are really excited to have a live concert and to be able to share what we have learned this year with our families and our friends and, of course, across on the live stream. One thing that we were very excited about with our music department this year was having the opportunity for the first time since 2019 to bring the fifth grade orchestra uh, and band students to hear the New Britain Symphony perform live. And we did that at the beginning of April. And that was just an amazing opportunity for our students to be able to see professional musicians who play their instruments. And it was just a really nice thing to be able to do together and to bring back um, as things are starting to bounce back in 2023. All right, without further ado, I am going to turn the program over to our students and I'm gonna ask for our first two students to come on up and welcome everybody. Good evening, everyone. My name is Nitya Desai, and I am a student at John Wallace Middle School. My name is Emma Ziegler, and I'm a student at John Wallace Middle School. We would like to welcome you to our spring concert. Before we begin, please take a moment to silence your electronic devices, including your cell phones. Our performances have worked hard, and we don't want them to get distracted. Also, please take a moment to notice the closest exit in case of an emergency. We hope you enjoy our concert. My name is Olivia and I'm a student at Martin Kellogg. My name is Avery and I am a student at John Wallace. My name is Ava and I'm a student at Martin Kellogg Middle School. This is our fifth grade orchestra. Most of our orchestra members are second year players if it, in fifth grade. We're, we are starting to learn about new bowing techniques like such as slurs. Also learn to use different fingerings 
to play new notes. Our first song is called Anthem of Triumph. It was composed in 2019 by Tyler Arcari. In the program notes that are in the score, Mr. Arcari dedicated this piece to all students who have, who have made it to their first spring concert. We hope you enjoy it. My name is Dia, and I'm a student at John Wallace. My name is Carter, and I'm a student at John Wallace. Our next piece is, ba is called Battle Stations. It was composed in 2016 by Francis J. Caravella. This short, intense piece is in the key of E minor. We have learned to play new notes, such as C naturals, in order to learn to play this piece. It also reinforces the fourth finger for the violin and viola players. We hope you all enjoy this piece.
My name is Lily, and I'm a student at John Wallace. My name is Olivia, and I'm a student at Martin Kellogg Middle School. We will, we will close our portion of tonight's concert with Cripple Creek. It was composed in 1993, and it is based on a traditional fiddle tune. It was arranged by Edmund J. Cernicki. Cripple Creek lets us showcase some of the new techniques we've learned this year. Some examples of these techniques include double stops, slurs, and fourth finger pizzicato. All right, how about another round of applause for our fifth grade orchestra? We, I do have one quick little business item that I need to uh, make sure everybody hears tonight. So when we're cleaning up, if your instrument belongs to you, okay, please bring it home with you tonight. If the instrument is one that you rented from our school, please return it to the rack you found it on. Okay? Sound good? All right.
My name is Lily McLaughlin, and I'm a student at John Wallace Middle School. My name is Amir, and I'm a student at Martin Kellogg Middle School. We hope you have enjoyed our portion of the concert. We would like to invite sixth grade orchestra to come on the stage to get ready for their portion of tonight's concert. There will be a brief pause while grade five leads the stage and grade six gets ready to perform for you. My name is Lily McLaughlin, and I'm a student at John Wallace Middle School. My name is Amir, and I'm a student at Martin Kellogg Middle School. We hope you have enjoyed our portion of the concert. We would like to invite sixth grade orchestra to come on the stage to get ready for their portion of tonight's concert. There will be a brief pause while grade five leaves the stage and grade six gets ready to perform for you.
My name is Deanna. I'm a student at Martin Kellogg Middle School. This is our sixth grade orchestra. Most of our orchestra members are third year players. In sixth grade, we are starting to learn how to tune our own instruments using our fine tuners. We also begin studying new time signatures, such as three, four time, as well as moving away from the key of D major and starting to play in the other keys. We also learn a lot about different forms of music. My name is Sophia, and I am a student at John Wallace Middle School. Our first piece is called Gunda Windy. It is a sharing song from Australia, and it was arranged by Robert W. Smith in 2003. This piece is supposed to imitate the sound of the shears at the rancher's shear the sheep. The song tune is repeated five times. We hope you enjoy. We had some fifth grade students joining us on that song. Fifth graders, could you wave your bows so we could see where you are? Thank you for joining us, fifth graders. All right. So while our fifth graders are getting themselves back to their seats in the audience. I'm gonna say a few things about our sixth grade orchestra this year. Um, our sixth grade orchestra has persevered and worked very, very hard. And we had some recognition for quite a few of our students. So back in March, there were a couple of different music festivals that were going on that were offered by our Connecticut Music Educators Association. One of them was the regional, Northern Region Middle School Festival which is an auditioned festival. It's a very rigorous audition process. Students have to memorize scales and they have to uh, learn to play a solo and there's sight reading involved. And I'm hopeful that very soon I will have the information on next year's um, audition process. It is open to students in grades six, seven, and eight. And there's also a level for high school students. 
one of our sixth graders, Zakai, was accepted into the Northern Region Middle School Festival on violin. So Zakai, would you stand up, please? We also had four students who were accepted into the Elementary Honors Orchestra, and two of them represented John Wallace, and two of them represented Martin Kellogg, and those four students were Isabella, who unfortunately could not be with us tonight, but Charlotte, and Julia, and Jason. So if you guys could please stand up, that would be great. All right, I am going to now turn this back over to our students to help us talk about what we learned this year. Good evening. My name is Grace, and I'm a student at John Wallace Middle School. Our next piece is called Fiddle into Boston. It is based on a classic fiddle tune and was arranged in 1999 by Frank J. Halverty. This arrangement uses some new techniques, including sliding into some of our notes and hand slapping. This was our song choice for our spring concert, and we hope you enjoy it. Our final piece for this portion of our concert is Can Can from the operetta Orpheus in the Underworld. It was originally written by Jacques Offenbach in 1858. 
Richard Meyer arranged this piece, the piece we are playing tonight in 1997. Hi, my name is Julia Hinton, and I'm a student at Martin Kellogg Middle School. We hope you have enjoyed our portion of this evening's program. I'm going to invite our seventh grade orchestra members to join us on stage at this time. There will be a brief pause while we transition to our next song.
I wanted to talk for just a quick second about this combination of students that are up on this stage right now. I feel that the transition sometimes uh, between grade levels can be a little challenging for students, but especially when you're asking seventh graders to sit in and play with the eighth graders and eighth graders to sit in and play with the seventh graders, that can sometimes be a little overwhelming for some of our students. So what I'm trying to do in grouping this group of students together is to have them have a little experience, get to know each other a little bit, get to play some songs together ahead of next year. So what you're really looking at right now is next year's seventh and eighth grade ensemble. So welcome to next year's seventh and eighth grade orchestra. My name is Marissa Stickles, and I'm a student at Martin Kellogg Middle School. We are going to perform a song called Dragon Hunter. It was written in 2003 by Richard Meyer. Dragon Hunter describes a dragon on the loose and the hunt to capture it. We hope you enjoy it. When we finish playing Dragon Hunter, there will be a brief pause while the sixth graders exit the stage and the eighth graders join the seventh graders on stage.
grade. Ooh, sorry. Eighth grade, come join us.
My name is Mila Stoser, and I'm a student at Martin Kellogg Middle School. We are going to begin our portion of tonight's concert with a piece called Star Wars Main Theme. It was composed by John Williams and was arranged by Larry Clark. This was the piece our eighth grade students chose to perform for a spring concert. We hope you enjoy it. My name is Cecilia Malinowski. I'm a student at Martin Kellogg Middle School. We have some sixth graders who passed their spring concert playing assessments early and have challenged up to learn to play to the next song. We're going to invite these students on stage now.
while our sixth grade orchestra members are getting their instruments um, together and ready to go, I would just like to just take a real quick minute to say thank you to everybody who helped with the concert. There is a list of people on the back of the program that um, I am especially appreciative of. This really is a town-wide effort to be able to put something like this together. Um, and it includes transportation, and it includes town maintenance for bringing all of our instruments back and forth between the different schools, and the cafeteria staff, and the, of course the administration and the staff at three schools, because it's not only the two middle schools, but the high school as well, and also to the high school students who came back to help tonight, the teachers who came back to help us out tonight. So we're very appreciative of all their efforts. I'm also... I'd also like to thank the students because I challenged you with some tough music, like the Star Wars piece we just did was very challenging and you rose to it. I'm quite pleased and proud of you. So what I would like to also do is to recognize our eighth grade students who are going to sadly be graduating from our middle schools next week or in 10 days or so. So eighth graders, would you please stand up so we can say thank you to all of you? had the easiest of times considering that your fifth grade year ended in 2020, but you persevered and you are ready to move right on and be ready for high school. But thank you for all your hard work and dedication to us for the past four years. All right, sixth grade, are we ready? Yes. All right, we're going to continue on with our program. We are going to end our, okay. our next piece is called Dragon Dances. It was composed in 2003 by Soon He Newbold. According to the program notes in the, sc the score, the dragon is a powerful and popular symbol in the Asian culture, representing strength and beauty. It is featured in art sculptures throughout stories throughout the world. As you listen to Dragon Dances, try to imagine magnificent dragons in flight or brightly colored costumes worn in Chinese New Year Parade. This song, this is the song our orchestra chose to perform at our spring concert, and it is one of the two songs we are going to perform at our adjudication music festival tomorrow.
My name is Alexandra Okamura, and I'm a student at Maureen Kellogg. We are going to end our performance for this evening with the finale from Symphony 5 by Ludwig van Beethoven. Beethoven composed this piece in 1808. Richard Mayer arranged this piece in 2003. We will also be performing this piece at our adjudication festival tomorrow. Thank you for coming to our concert. Have a good night. Thank you so much for your support, and we look forward to seeing you for our winter concert next year. All right. <laughs>